So right now we're going to start reading our article, Winds of Hope by Katie Duffield. So in order to do this, we're going to take a look at our goal of the day. So our goal is I can monitor and clarify as I read. So when I'm monitoring something, it means that I'm checking in on it. So I'm going to be checking in on my reading. And to clarify means to make clear. So I'm going to think about, do I need to check in on my reading to see if I really understand it? And if I don't understand it, that's totally okay because I'm going to make it a little bit more clear for myself. So I'm going to ask, do I understand what I just read? And then this is called a flow chart. So what you're going to do is you're going to ask yourself this question, do I understand what I just read? If yes, great. That means that I can keep reading. If I answer no, that's also okay. I find that sometimes my mind will be wandering as I'm reading and I sit there and I think, oh, I don't even know what I just read. So when I ask myself, do I understand what I just read? Sometimes the answer is no. Sometimes the answer is no for two different reasons. Because you don't understand a word that you just read. And if that's the case, you're going to try and decode it. So sound it out. See if you can think of a word that it sounds kind of like that you recognize from a different reading. You can look for context clues as you read the text. Is it does it remind you of something? You could try replacing it with a word that you do know, or you could look it up in the dictionary or in a glossary. And we've got lots of resources, so you can always type in the word in the dictionary um, on your computer, or you can use a physical dictionary. So then the other thing that you might find is that, no, I don't understand what I just read because the text was confusing. Um, and that happens to me a lot when my mind is wandering, that I'm just like, oh, I just don't really understand. So when I don't understand something, I go back and I reread the section that I don't understand. I try and make notes about what it was that I was reading. So who the section was about, what was going on, what were some important details. Think about what you do know. Reread and look for details that you might have missed. So you might not have realized which person was speaking or what the section was really about. And then you're going to look at images and text features. So you could look to see maps or some pictures on the page to give you clues about what the section is really trying to say. So bearing this in mind, as we're reading our article today, we're going to stop at some key spots to really monitor our reading and clarify so that we understand what's going on.